Hi guys, I'm Alex and this is a only two years old X1 Carbone from Lenovo, a ThinkPad, and the battery is broken. So I show you in this video how to disassemble the laptop, how to replace the battery with the original, that's the best option, or with a compatible. I In this video I use a compatible battery and let's do it. So remove all the screws. Or open. I'm already removed some of the screws. One, two, three, four, five. So I remove the last two screws. Oh, but not remove. It's in the K. It's in the bottom cover included. So you don't have to remove it. You have to only open the screws here. So every screw is opened, and then you can use a plastic clip or an old credit card or something and go on this side here and you can see it. Be very, very careful and you can see it. Oh, clip, 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 clip. Oh, oh, do you see? Check if every screw is removed and so now some of the plastics so you can see it here, it's difficult, be careful. And the last screw, so we can see what's the problem. Be careful, remove the screws and voila. Now we can see this is the laptop. So here you can find the solid state disk. You can use a screwdriver, a normal screwdriver here and Oh, I do it for you. So, screw number one, screw number two, and this is the cover with a paste. So, and now you can replace it with a NVMe with the other. Remove this. Okay. Be careful. We'll use this plastic card here. Voila. And now, in this case, we have this type. And now you can replace it with another if your solid state disk is damaged or something. So, so, and back with that. Careful. So. Everything have to fit in and back with the two screws. So second screw and here you can see the fans. So it's a very tiny little fan so you can Clean this fans here with air pressure, a little bit air pressure. Be very, very careful. And you can replace the complete unit here. You can remove the screws. Under there is the CPU. You can do it with new, with new thermal paste or something. And that's the, the whole cooling area. And that's, what is that? And that's the, the, the part for the, yeah, here is integrated for cell phone and now we want to replace and you can also see the completely top case the top cover with the with the keyboard is the is the base for everything so for the motherboard here this little tiny thing is the motherboard so if you want to replace the complete keyboard you have to buy a complete top cover with the keyboard and put everything everything to the other side. So now we want to replace the battery. That's why I do this video. And you can see it here is from 2023, the battery. Oh, so sad to see, but remove the screws here. I'm already, you can see it here, one, two, three, four. I'm already removed the some of the screws. One, two, one, two, three, four, five six screws one two three four 
five, six screws. And now, voila, here is the battery with this hole. Now you can take a better look what I mean. So <laughs> that's the touchpad. Here is the keyboard integrated, many, many parts with glue and something and be very, very careful. So I'm uh, so happy that only I only replaced the battery. So I uh, get the new battery here it's from, it's from a Vitas or something. You have to check it. It's the same battery size. Okay, you can check everything here on the description. So five fifteen point four four. Okay, okay. So and now, careful. Back here is important that the connectors are here connected, so and everything fits. And then back with all the screws here. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, we have time. So <laughs> you can see it in my other videos. I'm not the normal perfect YouTube guy with perfect cameras, perfect, everything is perfect. So that's the real life situation. You can see it here. Do it for my customer. And no takes, no cuts. So one take video and so something to show. Yeah, okay. It, under there, now it's, it's it's covered by the battery. Here is the cable for the BIOS battery under there. So if you Want to replace the BIOS battery? You have to disassemble here this part. Here is the solid state disk, and you can see, yeah, the RAM is, I think, under there, is integrated in the motherboard. So you can, in this case, you can upgrade, can't upgrade with more RAM. So I show you in this video how to replace the battery can clean the fan, how to replace the solid state disk and how to replace after many, many, many years the BIOS battery. And if you have any questions, write in the comments and good luck.